Now let's take a closer look at the lab modules. The Wenjian Lab is mainly for the scientific research of life in space, including the growth and development of different types of plants, animals, and microorganisms. For example, here is a key experimental cabinet called Universal Biological Cultivation Module, where the rice and Arabidopsis are planted. In fact, Chinese taconauts and students on the ground carried out an experiment in which the same seed was planted. The seeds grow under different gravity conditions, enabling them to study the mechanisms of growth. The Mengtian is mainly for the scientific research of microgravity. In addition to the 13 cabinets inside Mengtian, there are also 37 payload positions outside the cabin. There is a special piece of equipment in the Mengtian lab module for releasing micro spacecraft. With the help of astronauts, the payload transfer tool, and the robotic arm, the equipment will eject small satellites weighing about 100 kilograms into orbit, just like a slingshot. So now you've seen everything from the outside to the inside. Nine international experimental projects selected from 17 countries and regions will be sent to the Tiangong later. In the future, overseas friends, astronauts, and scientists are all welcome to work and live in China's space station. The starry sky is vast and bright. Chinese and foreign scientists will join together to explore more possibilities of the vast universe on the big platform known as the Tiangong.